What up fam, welcome back to our channel, I'm Deb. And before we get into much today, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell to be notified. Because that bell ain't ringing, then your phone will be singing. So if you don't see the parentheses on that side of that bell, then that means you won't be notified when we drop good eats like these. Well, what we have on the menu today, we got some asparagus. Let me, let me lift this up for you guys. We got some asparagus, some barbecue legs, some barbecue thighs some spanish capitas, a broccoli and rice casserole that Bay made from scratch, and some devil eggs that she made to throw in on, on the meal. We got barbecue sauce, hot sauce all on deck, and Bay made some honey, so I'm gonna pour that up and we'll be right back. So, we got a lot of new family members. Hey everybody, how y'all doing? Thanks for stopping by giving us a chance. For everyone else that's a regular, how you been? What have you been eating on? And have you a good bite of this um, barbecue honey chicken? They made us some nice homemade tea while we were um, preparing this meal. I'll be to my talk to himself in just a moment. Would you like some Spanish pizzas? You cut up with that tea. Mm -hmm. You cut up with the tea because you know I'm not even normally huge on drinking tea. The and then nice swoop in with the broccoli casserole. I know my first time making it. Could have fooled me. Yep. 
already. Probably with little nibbles earlier. Yep. And babe, I think I'm gonna start um like having video segments. Like um letters to my sons, things like that. Mm -hmm. Like this could be a start of it. With one I'm by myself. Oh. It's easier for me talk to talk about. to them. Mm-hmm. Actually play on there like that. I hope you all won't have an issue with that, but I believe it'll be more advantageous and beneficial, like having videos to where because I do believe that'll be more flow more fluid conversation and something that'd be beneficial because let's face it you never know what time is your time so I'd much rather kind of start having like concrete guidance and play so that my kids if if one day like one of my sons has a question if I start these kind of videos now by the time they get old enough to have that question you know sometimes your kids aren't ready to talk to you when you're ready to talk to them so that could be a video that he's already watched to get an understanding to get his composure to come talk to me and he can show his friends he'll be teaching everybody mm -hmm. well teaching more because you know, like, yeah, me and out there. Yes. Because so many people say Shiver is dead. My dad's either one or what. Split my wig if I didn't open the door for a woman or an elderly person. I just wonder why they were so hard on it about that though. Because they said patience is a virtue. So if you're that much in a rush in life to where you can't hold the door for a woman, be a young lady or a woman older than you, then where are you in life mm -hmm. if you can't take that? kind of time out so that was one of those things to drive home that patience is a virtue and kind of to instill patience and compassion in something as simple as opening doors because it slows you up I don't teach that anymore. Nope. And they're definitely not teaching that at school. We'd rather use the language to refer to our females. And I can't say women because sometimes you've got teenage girls that are referred to in the same manner. 
Mm -hmm. By their teenage boyfriends. So you gotta be able to have those candid discussions with your kids. That's why I'm scared to have a girl though. Because girls are going to deal with more. Than a guy? Yep. You think? Mm-hmm. In what sense? Tolerating what they'll tolerate. I think it's a little bit harder raising a young man in this time that we have going on. Mm -hmm. I think it's scarier. When I was start, when I thought about, well, when I now what we say it was this way. I never thought when I started having kids that I'd be like scared for their life. I didn't think about kids like in that sense. Mm. Until they actually, you know, got here or got <laughs> inside of me and now I'm like. You thought about all the happy, jolly, go lucky stuff. Mm hmm. But if I'm older now, you start thinking about different things. Mm-hmm. And 500 bad things. Because it's really crazy stuff going on there. It really is. All the time. And it's like no matter what you do, it's still a. Hit and miss on ducking it. Used to be you could be in your house and be fine. Now people even want to try to be bold enough to really invade those spaces even more so now. It is season fam, so y'all gonna be seeing stuff like grilled chicken, grilled chicken, grilled lamb, grilled burgers, grilled hot dogs. If we can get some good ones in stock, grilled alligator, grilled rabbit. Oh no, you want too far. I don't know why you stuck for the fam. I will not be in those videos. Rabbits are not to eat. Why? They are pigs. Chicks are just so misunderstood. Chicks? Chickens. Chickens are one of the only animals that no one associates with pets, so <laughs> everybody just writes them off. It's okay to kill them and eat them. Who wants a pet chicken? Farmers have pet chickens. No, not pets. They have chickens. Stranger things have happened. Who want a chicken as a pig? But still, okay. Let's even nix that. 
No pits. So rabbits get a pass over chickens? What? To be a pet? No. You don't feel bad about nobody killing the chicken, but you feel bad about somebody killing the rabbit. Mm -hmm. That's so unfair. What chicken supposed to do? What rabbits are supposed to do? Be a part of the wildlife. Be cute. Be a, my pet. For my kids. For me. To cuddle. Can you cuddle a chicken? No. Babe, you're so animalist. You're probably trying to pick your eye out. Babe, you're animalist. <laughs> probably what you want. So we're trying to say I'm racist against animals, basically. Mm-hmm. Because I can eat a chicken, but not a rabbit. And you have this, and you have the feeling that chickens are guaranteed to be able to try to hurt you, but rabbits aren't. What can a rabbit do to me? Look it up. Scratch my eyes out. So we're supposed to eat monkeys too? No, nah, monkeys are limits. <laughs> <clears throat> They're like cannibalism because they like our close cousins. What? For real? Nah, they animals. No. <laughs> they get a they in their own category. They primates. <laughs> no, we eating animals. No. They protect it. <laughs> <laughs> they were kind of like they were officially like inducted as like one of the accepted species. Uh, oh, excuse me. What they feel? Yeah, they protected. You know so how like the lions. US, you know how like the U.S. has territories. So we can eat lions? Hold on, wait, 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 wait. I know what you're saying, but we can eat lions? No. Okay, why not? Because they're endangered. <laughs> we can eat leopards and... Who? Leopards and cheetahs and... Baloos. If it's not on the endangered species list, then it's free game. I'm pretty sure rabbits on there. What? <laughs> you ain't never heard the term like rabbits. Rabbits had whole litters out here. We got four kids, I'm sure. I heard the term. So how you gonna say that rabbits are on the endangered species list? Just cause they out there. And getting their rabbit on and having rabbits them. is being reproduced all the time. Yes. Some rabbits might have a tooth side or might be in menopause. Mm -mm. If a male rabbit breathes on a female rabbit, she pregnant. <laughs> if you breathe on me, I'm pregnant. Too bad it couldn't make it have no twins though. Or five hundred little rabbits. We could have had like we could have been finished. We could have had like three more. Boom, one spade. Boom, done. You lost your man. <laughs> Well, fam, sadly I couldn't get through all of it, but you know how it is when you're cooking, especially grilling, you nibble. So, 
in the bottom of some in the mail. I keep on craving some grilled chicken so they'll see it again. And sadly, we have come to that point in the video. Well, we must well, let y'all go. We must let you guys go. So, until next video, fam. Love you guys.